This is a list of video games that have been censored or banned by governments of various states in the world. Governments that have banned video games have been criticized for a correlated increase in digital piracy, limiting business opportunities and violating rights. Topic: Argentina. Topic: Australia. Topic: Brazil. Brazil has banned many video games since 1999, mainly due to depictions of violence and cruelty, making it illegal to distribute and otherwise sell these games. Additionally, the Brazilian advisory rating system requires that all video games be rated by the organization, where unrated video games are banned from being sold in Brazil. Bans often do not extend to digital platforms. China. A very large number of video games are banned in the People's Republic of China, games that contain drugs, sexual themes, blood, depictions of organized crime or the defaming of the Chinese government are almost always banned from sale. Because of the large size of the Chinese video game market, many studios will edit the content of their games to conform to the government's standards. Home gaming consoles were banned in mainland China from June 2000 until 2013, when the ban was lifted. Next generation consoles such as the Xbox One and PlayStation 4 were allowed in the country. Notable games banned in that region are Topic: <laughs> Cuba. No video games have ever been banned in Cuba, but few games were sold in that country until 2007 when restrictions were eased. In 2010, the video game Call of Duty, Black Ops gained much controversy as there is a mission where the player attempts to assassinate Fidel Castro, only to end up killing a double. Denmark EA Sports MMA was not released in Denmark because of a law prohibiting marketing for energy drinks, which EA chose not to remove from the game. However, distribution is not illegal, as the game can still be found on shelves as an import. <laughs> <laughs> European Union In 2006, after Italian news magazine Panorama and then Roman mayor Walter Veltroni claimed that Rule of Rose contained violence towards minors at the protagonist's hand, European Commissioner Franco Frattini further supposed that the game prompted players to violate a little girl in the most horrible conditions, then torturing her before killing her in the worst of sufferances. He wrote a letter to the EU's ministers of interior and proposed a bill to the commission, calling for a total ban of the game for minors. The proposal was ultimately voted, following Localizer 505 Games' dismissal of Frattini's statements, as well as fellow Commissioner Vivian Reading's open letter backing PEGI's 16-plus rating of the game. <laughs> <laughs> Germany A video game can be banned in Germany if it has been confiscated by court order because it violates a section of the Strafgesetzbuch criminal code. Private possession and thus playing it and acquisition such as downloading a demo from the internet is still legal, but any dissemination is not. The seller would break the law if a sale took place, not the buyer. On December 10, 2002, however, one German court Ham decided that a single sale of a single copy does not qualify as dissemination. Unlike indexing by the BPJM, which restricts the sale of all content equal versions, the versions that are confiscated are enumerated in the court order. Being put on the index by the BPJM or, since April 1, 2003, being refused a rating by the USK does not equal a ban. Rather, it imposes strict trade restrictions on the title. While only very few games have been confiscated, the list of indexed games is very long. In December 2006, just one month after the EMS Detton school shooting, Bavaria and Lower Saxony proposed legislation, to be presented to the national parliament, that would make even playing any game that feature cruel violence on humans or human-looking characters 
an offense punishable with fines or jail time of up to 12 months. Section 86A outlaws the use of symbols of unconstitutional organizations. Section 130 Volksverhetzung, agitation of the people, and Section 131 Instructions for Crimes. In the official lists, these three sections are always bundled, so any game that contains swastika flags and or any depiction of Adolf Hitler is listed alongside racist propaganda pieces. This law was lifted on August 8, 2018. Section 131 outlaws representation of excessive violence in media, which describe cruel or otherwise inhuman acts of violence against human or humanoid beings in a manner which expresses a glorification or rendering harmless of such acts of violence or which represents the cruel or inhuman aspects of the event in a manner which injures human dignity. Section 130 and Section 131 make it to a criminal offense to do following with corresponding scriptures Distributing, selling Issuing in public, demonstrating or otherwise making available Leaving it to a person under the age of 18 Producing, buying, delivering, storing, offering, announcing, praising, importing or exporting to use them within the meaning of the letters 1 to 3. This means, that the import or purchase and the possession for personal use are still legal for persons over 18 years. In the case of video games that contain pornography with children or minors, where a real or realistic event is depicted, the possession of the video game or working towards possessing it would be illegal under Section 184b or Section 184 CSTGB. Otherwise, if the work depicts a fictitious event, the distribution of such material is illegal. In August 2008, Sega confirmed that The House of the Dead, Overkill and Madworld would not be released in Germany, due to the likelihood that they would be refused to get a rating by the USK. Sega also announced in November 2009 that they would not distribute Aliens vs. Predator for similar reasons, a Beschlagnemung ban is enforced for a minimum of 10 years, after which a request for review may be submitted. Although the bans usually don't extend to the digital versions, local versions are still toned down in depictions of violence and similar content to be classified by the USK without any rulings. <laughs> Greece No known games have been banned in Greece. A law banning all electronic games in public places was passed in 2002, but eventually disregarded. Iran Iran typically bans any game that contains violence, depicts cruelty, features strong sexual content, nudity, or portrays the Middle East negatively. Battlefield 3 was banned because it presented a fictional U.S. invasion on Tehran. Even before the ban, many retail stores were removing copies of the game from their shelves. Pokemon Go was banned due to security reasons, Valkyrie Drive, Bakuni was banned because of excessive themes of glorifying homosexual and immoral values. It does not extend to digital distribution, however. Republic of Ireland The IFCO rarely rates video games, and leaves decisions to PEGI and BBFC. Manhunt 2 was banned for "...gross, unrelenting, and gratuitous violence", but the ban was later lifted and the game was given a PEGI 18 rating. <laughs> Italy In 2006, following the release of the trailer to the game Rule of Rose, magazine Panorama ran an article claiming live burials of children at the protagonist's hand. Shortly after, then-mayor of Rome, Walter Veltroni, called for a ban of the game in Italy. The game's European publisher, 505 Games, dismissed these claims, and no formal movement of a ban was made following Veltroni's comments. In 2007, following the decision of the governments of the United Kingdom and Ireland, the Minister of Communications Paolo Gentiloni publicly expressed the desire to block the distribution of Manhunt 2 in Italy, due to the gratuitous violence and excessive cruelty of the video game, but the censorship was never put into practice. <laughs> Japan 
Video games are rarely banned in Japan, and it holds the place as one of the top video game producers in the world. However, Fallout 3 was edited in Japan due to two reasons, a quest named The Power of the Atom, which gave the player a choice to nuke a city named Megaton, which caused part of the quest to be removed, and a weapon in the game called the Fat Man. Because of its relation to the real historic event, the weapon was renamed to the Nuka Launcher in the Japanese version of Fallout 3. Japan's spike removed all references to Kim Jong-il and North Korea in Homefront, as well. Resident Evil 4, Call of Duty, Black Ops, Bulletstorm, Gears of War 3, Grand Theft Auto 5, Dead Island, Metal Gear Rising, Revengeance and numerous other violent titles physical and digital were heavily edited for excessive violence but this is on a localization level only, the games can be played intact if they are switched to English instead of Japanese. Malaysia Malaysia tends to ban offensive content such as extreme impact violence, depictions of cruelty, any content considered anti-Muslim, sexual content and nudity. In August 2008, after the Grand Theft Auto series ban in Thailand see below, head of a Malaysian consumer rights organization, Muhammad Idris, called for the ban of Grand Theft Auto series entirely and every other similarly violent video games such as Manhunt series and Mortal Kombat. In February 2010, one week after Dante's Inferno released, the game was banned by Jabatan Agama Islam in Malaysia for offensive depictions of cruelty, hellish visions, sexuality, and content that was against Sharia. In 2016, with the following release, Pokemon Go was banned by the Federal Territory for Muslims for promoting the search for power, which leads to gambling and safety issues that was caused by playing the game. It was later lifted following massive backlash on social media and an update slightly modifying security measures on the app. In September 2017, the Malaysian Communications and Multimedia Commission MCMC blocked access to the entire Steam store, following the discovery of a controversial fighting game involving religious deities, Fight of Gods. The ban was lifted one day later after Valve agreed to block the game in Malaysia. Mexico Though no video games have ever been nationally banned, Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Advanced Warfighter 2 was banned in the state of Chihuahua due to Mexican rebels being depicted as antagonists and stereotyping the city of Chihuahua and Ciudad Juarez. However, the game can still be found in shelves in other states. Topic New Zealand In New Zealand, games are classified by the country's Office of Film and Literature Classification. If they are dubbed objectionable in all cases, then they are considered banned. In this case, the game in question is not only illegal to sell, but illegal to own, possess, or import. Games are typically banned and classified as objectionable content when they contain extreme violence, offensive depictions of cruelty, animal cruelty, sexual content involving children, or graphic depictions of sexual content, including sexual fetishes that are offensive and abhorrent depictions of urination, bestiality, necrophilia, urophilia, coprophilia, and or incest. North Korea. North Korea bans all foreign video games and very few games are known to be developed in North Korea. Pakistan Philippines In 1981, a presidential decree issued by Ferdinand Marcos outlawed the use and distribution of all video game consoles, arcade games and pinball machines, deeming them as a destructive social enemy and to the detriment of the public interest. Despite the law being technically in effect following the EDSA revolution, it has since been disregarded and unenforced. While no video games are banned nationwide so far since 1986, at least one title, Defense of the Ancients, has been banned at a barangay in Desmariñas, Cavite following complaints of delinquency issues, and two murder incidents involving youths in the area resulting from brawls in relation to the game. Saudi Arabia 
Most of these games can be found in some stores often at a substantial price due to the government's lack of enforcing the banning of these games. Many major stores, however, will not stock the following banned titles. Russia In Russia, games are classified by the on protecting children from information harmful to their health and development. Federal law. No known games have been banned in Russia due to excessive violence, nudity, negative portrayal of people of Russia or expression of religious views of any kind because of the freedom of speech guaranteed by the Constitution of Russia. Media in the United States and Europe have incorrectly reported that Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 2, which features a storyline in which Russian ultranationalists take control of the country and invade the United States, was banned in Russia. Activision called these reports erroneous. Topic: <inaudible> Singapore. Singapore rarely bans games. With the implementation of the video game classification in 2008 by the Media Development Authority, most games are widely available for purchase to their respective age group, such as those containing full frontal nudity or strong graphic violence under an M18 rating. Games that were previously banned such as Mass Effect were re-rated either Age Advisory or M18 after the implementation of the classification system. South Korea Since 2006, South Korea offers complete freedom in publishing games, fully respecting freedom of expression and speech. Even before this, games were very rarely banned unless that game mentioned elements of the Korean War in order to avoid tensions between the North Korea and South Korea. However, Manhunt, Manhunt 2, and Mortal Kombat are still banned because of violence and cruelty. Grand Theft Auto 3, Grand Theft Auto, Vice City and Mercenaries, Playground of Destruction were previously banned but later lifted. The Game Rating Board requires that all video games be rated by the organization. Unrated titles are absolutely banned from being sold in the country, and websites selling them can be blocked. Topic: <laughs> Thailand Thailand will typically ban any games with excessive violence, and sexual content, such as many eroge from Japan, with the same reasons as banning any pornographic films. Additionally, all video game titles of the Grand Theft Auto series have been banned in Thailand completely since August 2008, because of an 18-year-old Thai player supposedly influenced by Grand Theft Auto who killed a taxi driver from Bangkok. The ban, however, does not extend to the digital PC versions of Grand Theft Auto 5 Tropico 5 is yet another title that has been banned. The military junta claims that it could affect peace and order within the country. United Arab Emirates In the United Arab Emirates, a branch of the government called the National Media Council NMC works to control the media and entertainment industry in the country, and they have the authority to issue bans on any specific media products, including video games, to comply with the country's legal and cultural values. The NMC do not usually explicitly state their actual consensus for any kind of issued ban on a product, so official reasons behind their bans remain unclear. However, bans issued by the NMC apply only to the sale of those products through local outlets, they do not make private ownership illegal. There are certain exceptions, notably for Spec Ops, the line see below. Some banned games may be available and sold in the nation's gray market. In 2018, the NMC introduced a localized rating system for various media, including video games. The following incomplete list of titles are banned from mainstream physical retail circulations. Topic: <laughs> United Kingdom Games in the UK usually only receive a ban when they contain real sex scenes or in gratuitous violence. PEGI age ratings are compulsory and are backed by legislation, taking effect on 30 July 2012. It is illegal to sell, buy or rent but legal to import a game that has not been classified by an approved age rating organisation in the UK. 
This only applies to games stored on physical media, not to downloadable media. United States In the United States, the Entertainment Software Rating Board ESRB, a self-regulatory organization, issues ratings for video games and enforces voluntary regulations on how they are marketed and sold. The Supreme Court ruled in Brown v. Entertainment Merchants Association, which challenged a California law restricting the sale of violent video games. Defined using a variation of the Miller test separate from ratings assigned by bodies such as the ESRB to minors, that video games were considered a protected form of expression under the First Amendment, meaning that federal or state law cannot be used to regulate their distribution based on content. However, games can still be recalled as the result of court orders. A nude model featured in the Guy game sued its developer and publisher over use of her likeness, as she was underage at the time of filming and thus could not personally consent to her depiction. All remaining copies of the game that contained her likeness were recalled from stores. In 2012, a court found that Silicon Knights had plagiarized Epic Games' proprietary Unreal Engine, and had used it in Two Human and X-Men, Destiny, along with other unreleased projects. The studio was ordered to recall and destroy all remaining copies, materials, and source code relating to the games, the ESRB's highest rating, Adults Only has been considered a total ban on the mainstream sale of certain games, as most retailers refuse to stock games carrying the rating, and they cannot be published on major video game consoles due to company policies. The release of Thrill Kill, an outrated fighting game with strong sexual themes, was outright cancelled by Electronic Arts who had acquired its developer due to objections over its content. Following the discovery of an incomplete sex minigame that was not included in the final game but could be accessed using a modification or cheating device, Grand Theft Auto, San Andreas was re-rated adults only and recalled by Rockstar Games, in favor of a new revision of the game that omitted the offending content entirely and carried the original mature rating. <laughs> Venezuela. In November 2009, the government of Venezuela announced that it would ban all video games in which the objective was to shoot people. The ban was due to widespread violence in the country. The bill was later published in the public journal of that country on 3 December and went into effect three months later, March 3, 2010, making Venezuela the first country to completely ban violent video games in the world and make their manufacturing, distribution, selling, rental, exhibition and use illegal. Even though the proponents were not from the Venezuelan government's political party, Partido Socialista Unido de Venezuela PSUV, President Hugo Chavez supported the ban, claiming there are some internet games featuring him so players can kill them, and even calling video games consoles, including Nintendo DS and Sony PlayStation, poison, and values of the capitalism, which he considers the road to hell. According to reports of the Venezuelan National Guard, more than 13,000 objects, including violent video games, were massively destroyed to date in the states of Lara and Portuguesa. The ban is criticized by gamers and experts alike for its ambiguity and lack of clarity on its penalties, aside from being too harsh and indoctrinating a negative point of view. On the other hand, Sony expressed their hopes for the government to make changes for the law for good. The ban extends to the digital versions of these games. See also Video game controversy List of regionally censored video games List of recalled video games List of books banned by governments List of controversial video games